All right, in this example, we're going to be given a three different vectors here. Um, so we've got vector u that starts at the point 0, 4 and stops at the point negative 2, 0. We have v that starts at the origin and stops at the point 3, 1. And then we have the vector w that starts at 6, 0 and stops at 6, 4. So what we're going to do is we're going to uh, sketch some new vectors based on those vectors. So in part A, we're going to look at u plus v plus w. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do, so we're, again, we're going to do vector u plus v plus w. The first thing I'm going to do is just think about vector u. So vector u, again, um, starts at the point 0, 4 and stops at ne uh, negative 2, comma 0. So there's vector u. When we uh, create new vectors, when we add vectors together, in terms of drawing them, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to take vector v. Wherever u stops, which is, well, right there, that's where vector v is going to start. So notice vector v. Um, that vector goes three units to the right and one unit up. So, so that we're sitting at negative 2. That means if I go three units to the right and one unit up, I'm going to stop at the point uh, 1, 1. So there's vector v. And now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to uh, add on vector w. So wherever v stops, w is going to start. So again, all vector w does is it basically just goes up four units vertically. So since we're sitting at, uh, you know, kind of at the y-coordinate of 1, if we go up four, uh, four units, we're now going to be sitting, um, this would now be at the point 1, comma, uh, 5. Okay, so it's kind of like you're taking a little walk. Walk along U, and then V tells you the direction to go next, and then W tells you the direction to go next. Our solution, though, is not this entire vector. Our solution is we take wherever we started, Okay, so we start there. We take wherever we finish, and we connect those. So I'm going to draw this graph one more time. So again, this point started at uh, 0, 4. It doesn't matter where you start these either. Okay, it doesn't matter at all where you start these. So 0, 4, and it says we basically stop at the, uh, at the point 1, 5. So our solution, again, if we look at where we started versus where we stopped, if we connect those, that's going to be this vector right here. And that is going to be our vector u plus v plus w. Okay, so the vector u plus v plus w would basically just be a little vector that goes one unit to the right and one unit upwards.